Yo, what's up guys? Chase the Bro here, and welcome back to part 20 of the level through PvP only series. In the recent video, we defeated the Fire Giant and made our way to Faramazula. We got quite a bit of PvP done as well. I'm now level 84 with plus 17 weapons. We ended with some invasions last time, so all these runes we have to use. We're just going to keep building upon them though and doing some more invasions here to start off. I can also do Alexander's questline since he's right there. We'll definitely do that after our invasions. Oh nice, a catacomb invasion with Artorius. Not Artorius, okay. Oh, and they're right in front of me, how convenient. Hello there guys. Ooh, Blasphemous Blade. Give you chocolate. Chocolate! <laughs> chocolate! A jump attack enthusiast. Well, this could be a good time for me to use the dagger talisman, I suppose. Victorious. Actually, maybe I should start keeping on the dagger talisman, to be honest. Whoa. I went to dodge there, but I think I pivoted too quickly, so I took my dodge away. I really wanted to get the phantom. I want the host to back up. Why is the phantom not aggressive? <laughs> Come in here and save your teammate. He needs you. He's throwing rocks at me. Aha! You weren't expecting that, were you? I, I, oh, I was able to dodge out of that faster than I thought I could. Well, now you know my secret. We're going to mix it up further. Hello there. That's right, I have, I have throwables. <laughs> That's a really weak bleed, though. Maybe bleed infused, but doesn't have, like, a lot of damage? Phantom seems like he's geared up for bleed. Oh god, Phantom, please, for the love, stop hiding behind the host. I'll trade him to that once. Yeah, you do good damage with that. Maybe it's just your katana that you don't do good damage with. Hmm. <laughs> this might be a good way to use it on the host, or the Phantom. The host is so aggressive, though. <laughs> I'm surprised that I actually hit him. Uh, let's get Flaming Strike involved here a little bit. I don't want to kill the host here, but... Probably throw fire at you. If we can get the host to be a... Wait, what happened? Oh, does Give Me Chocolate have just, like, no health whatsoever? That seems to be the case. I just seen 400 damage and it was entire health bar. We dodged the bleed proc. I can backstab that, but I didn't. <laughs> that was my own fault. Hosty. I need you to relax. It was smart going behind me there. Hi hey there. Oh, man. He really is protecting his phantom. <laughs> it's kind of funny. You love to see it, though. Good teamwork. Host, go away, host, man. You have like 2 HP, I want the Phantom. Alright, let's get this for some uh, L2 action. <laughs> L2? Yeah. <laughs> you think I'll do the whole thing? Probably not. Oh, well, the trap got him. <laughs> How much souls are you worth, Phantom? 1,400. Oh, not high level at all. Well, then. We end it with the win. Goodbye, Artorius. Fun fight, though. I still find it so funny that the Phantoms are more defensive than the hosts. The Royal Capital with Iron Wolf Locasi or Locasi. Iron Wolf, huh? Hello guys, how are you? Two great swords. Hello. I'm enjoyer of the great sword as well. Let's go. You don't see great sword battles too often. What in the backstab attempt? I don't remember asking for that. Wait, why am I only fighting the host? You can get involved, Phantom. I totally want you in here, to be honest. <laughs> I rolled back into that. <laughs> mm, boink. 
It's tough when you trade with the first part of Flaming Strike because, well, quite honestly, you don't get the follow-up, and that's where all the damage comes from. A uh, moon rail. <laughs> False 1v1s. Whee! Here we go here. And heal. Nice. We have an excuse to kill the Phantom now, though. I love that. Perfect. That is not a high-level Phantom, though. Unfortunately. Some runes, though. I will take those. Much appreciated. Let's get some stamina regen going here. Hey, a Banished Knight Greatsword. <laughs> Only downside of the Claymore R2. You really want to aim it a little left. It tends to miss on its own going all the way to the right. What is arrows? <laughs> RT. RT. Free aiming it is definitely the best option. You can like aim it where it's going right as they get stunned. Oh, I thought I could reverse get that backstab. Our latency isn't the best to me in the host here. Oh god. That's crazy health. Crazy low amounts of health, sorry. <laughs> Fun fight though, Iron Wolf. 17k, not bad, not bad, total. Still can't get a level, but we're probably able to upgrade our weapons a little bit. I just seen the name J. Oh, J is the host, okay. Oh, they're all the way over there. Can we talk about that spawn also? What? <laughs> I feel like I constantly find new spawns that I've never had before. Oh boy, hello there. Team of three, Geralt of Rivia. Hello, Geralt. How are you? That's a interesting sword you got there, Geralt. You guys are rocking some big swords. I don't know if the lance will be able to deal with this damage. Oh, I don't have a lot of HP. It'll be okay then. Oh boy. Well, I'll I'll take it. I'll truly take that. That was terrifying. <laughs> One phantom. Oh, uh, we want to take care of him first. Wait, where? Oh. He's just teleporting away. Why did he run away from the host? What the heck? Okay, I'm not going to kill the host. I'm just so confused as to why the guy with the rune greatsword just took off. Straight gone. Where are you going, friend? You're not... Unless he's the host with the ring. Oh my god. Is that their strat? If so, that's absolutely hilarious. No, he's not the host. There's no strat. <laughs> what are you doing here? <laughs> that is a very unstable internet connection you have there, my friend. Um, what if I just did this, though? Yeah, that seems to work. He doesn't roll. Nice. <laughs> just runs away. <laughs> Abandons his friend. Good amount of souls, maybe? Do I even get the souls? We'll see. They'll they'll arrive to me. If it, there they are. 13k. Okay. Yeah, that was definitely worth doing. <laughs> Pretty funny. Um, host? Hello there. How are you? I've come back. <laughs> Your friend was, uh, interesting, to say the least. <laughs> I am sorry we have to do you in that way, but that was a hilarious invasion. One falls off cliff of own accord, the other one leaves. <laughs> okay, so we have our dagger at 17, Shamshir 17. I think most of the weapons that we use are 17, except for the Zweihander. One thing I'd love to have is a Colossal. We definitely don't have the weight load for the Greatsword anytime soon. I figured we'd be higher level by now, so I think we'll start investing back into the Zweihander. I'm going to need some stone fours, fives, and sixes. Oh, also, what is this? Corrin's bell bearing. I swear I never seen him at Altus. <laughs> I think he was standing here until recently. Maybe I never spoke to him again. Well, that's unfortunate. All right, so stone fours, we need nine of to have 12 to get that up there. And then we need, again, 12 of these. So nine more of the stone fives, and then I have the stone sixes. So that's good. All right, Zweihander, you ready to come back into the full 11? 12, 13, 14, 15. Oh, I lack the runes, but at least it's level 15. 
We're catching up on a few things we didn't grab up until now. Unfortunately, it is 10,000 runes, so I'm going to have to keep that in mind. I would love to have that on my weapons right now. Chilling Mist would be awesome. It just is so sad that when you cold infuse this weapon, it becomes a dexterity scaling weapon. It's very unfortunate. While I'm here, let's mix up the Ash of Wars a little bit. I've been using Impaling Thrust on the Claymore for a long time. Let's do something new. You know what I want to do that I tried out recently? Gravitas on it. It's pretty funny. If they get caught by it, you can get an R2 roll catch, and then you can reset the fire with Flaming Strike. I think I'll keep on Stormblade. This Ash of War is just too good. The Lance could do with a change up here. Maybe Storm Assault? All right, let's try these out for now. I'll mix them up a little bit more afterwards if I don't like it, but I think I like what we have going right now. With our leftover runes, let's just buy a few of the higher level stone sixes. A few, I get one. Okay. <laughs> and then we'll buy a stone two. And we can get a stone one. Look at that. Perfect. Here I come for my shard of Alexander. I'm going to swap up our rings a little bit as well. I definitely want to boost our endurance more. That would be nice. What the? Oh wait, yeah, these rise again. I forget about that all the time. Ow. <laughs> Who threw that? Oh. It's actually a crossbow. You know what? When going through the PvE area like this, I feel like it's beneficial to wear the... What in the... It's facing that way. Lots of benefits to regen when you're going through a playthrough. Hello there. Oh, two crossbow lads. Oh, that's a lot of you, actually. What if I did this? It actually does pretty decent damage. I don't expect it to. <laughs> Get ducked. Probably go through the whole area just using backstabs. <laughs> Keep your HP full. What's this? Oh, a somber seven. You golden arrow. Okay. Someone else is shooting arrows at us. I do remember this particular skeleton being quite tanky. Hello there. Oh, quite tanky indeed. <laughs> With some crazy hyper armor as well. He may be weak to fire? I don't know. No, definitely not. Alright. Gravel stones. <laughs> Still getting shot at over there. There's the grace in front of me, but we can also get to it by going this way. I just forget what items are down here. I already killed one of you. I don't want to do it again. Um, oh! Hey there. Let's use our physic. This is going to become a lot of enemies eventually. By eventually, I mean like right now. Now, I forget. There's a way to go up where I just was, but is there more important items over here? I drop down here eventually. Another one of you. I'll take that HP boost, though. Fire. Flamethrower. All that for a rune. <laughs> okay. So we do go up the other way. Yes. <laughs> what the? Did you reassemble on the other side of that? That's funny. Doesn't one of the skeletons here like rise up? Can we get the item maybe? No? Oh, that was surprisingly easy. Thought there'd be an enemy here. Oh, there was. How'd you guys take so long to get up? Maybe they're meant to hit you on the cliff when you're, like, looking away. <laughs> like they almost did for me. Now we get the grace. There we go. Now the question is, do I want to head that route or can we jump down here? 
I suppose we can go down here really quick. Oop, there might be some useful items. I remember being able to roll off. There we go, yeah. Hey, item over there, look at that. Oh yes, there are many banished knights around here. I believe... They have a lot of health. I'm just gonna throw that out there. They are tanky. <laughs> Boy, are they. Is there just one on this platform? No, I definitely hear it. No, I definitely hear a second one over there. We just have to take care of this one quickly. You don't notice me putting on the dagger ring. No, 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 no. You don't notice that at all. Oh boy, that's damaging. Front flips, I don't remember that. All right, we definitely wanna get rid of the dual greatsword one first. It's like fighting the boss fight all over again. All right, there we go. Oh yeah, that combos, that's right. <laughs> Banish knights would never not be hard. In a pack, anyway. I feel like alone they're fine, you can kind of chain stun them, but when there's multiple, pretty difficult. Um, I guess we keep on the stamina talisman. Anything else out here? No? Oh yeah, an item. Sometimes the items are like perfectly placed with the sky color, and I can't tell what they are. What's this? Azula Beastman ashes, okay. And then there's a grace here as well, right? Now, I don't know what the god skins would be weak against, but it might be useful to hit them with regen a little bit. Maybe we should put Prayerful Strike on this. Just for the boss fight, to have some health regen. We can frostbite them with the claymore, but maybe use a different Ash of War. I feel like Sword Dance comes out pretty quick. That could be pretty useful. Then Flaming Strike and have a physical damage weapon as well. Also, I don't do this often, but maybe we can craft a couple sleep pots. Could be useful, who knows. Before we actually walk in, let's throw on our Ritual Shield Talisman and also have the sleep pots on the bar. Now, I'm not sure of their weaknesses, but we have... Which one do I want to sleep? Maybe one of my first attacks should be the pot, just to... That's right on your body. Maybe that'll put him to sleep. Yeah, okay. Then we can go for you. Now, I don't know who's the easier one to fight, to be honest, but... Give me some stamina regen here. Also, our physic would be smart as well. Keep regen going the whole fight. Oh, I forget how delayed that attack is. That one's also pretty delayed. This is a little close to death, so we'll heal. Right, I want to find an opening for this. I want to buff it. <laughs> Although he keeps counterattacking and like could go for it. It'd be a trade, so. Not beneficial. This we can probably punish. And get punished for it. <laughs> okay. I don't know how long those last, so. That's new to me. I never use sleep pots. Oh boy. Well, I suppose I want to keep sleeping the same one, right? Because he's currently weak. Oh boy. That lunge is, oh, so delayed. It's like piercing fang, basically. Okay, long range punish man. Here, take this. Perfect. That should hit. Keep you in it. Put you back to sleep. Makes this a little bit more manageable. Oh man. Oh. Thought I was on my claymore. We take a trade. Actually, I wonder how effective Frostbite might be. Oh! Excuse me. Perfect. Now we're gonna need FP back. But I do want to open with something really heavy to see if we can frostbite him. We got to crit off three heavies, okay. 
And we did get the frostbite. Pretty beneficial. Let's buff and reset it. <laughs> the belly bounce. Well, now we do pretty good damage. I don't want to trade it away just yet. <laughs> no! Oh, he spawned him right in my face. Oh, excuse me. This will save my life. Oh my god, imagine that would have hit me right out of the iframes. That would have been terrifying. Alright, now that I know Frostbite works... We're gonna use the Claymore a little bit here. Oh. <laughs> the timing is impeccable. We have seven Estes left. Okay. Not so bad, especially since we have some regen. How long does that last, I feel like? Yeah, I think I have the timing down on- No! Did I stop it? I might have stopped the summoning. Oh, that's huge if I did. Nice. What happens now, actually? Oh, one just spawns in my face. I see. <laughs> Noted. <laughs> oh. Oh. I don't know all of your moves off fire. I know there's a second follow-up to that one, though. I'm so thankful the belly bounce did not hit me right there. Oh, when I ducked it, perfect. Nice. Okay. The sleep pots are definitely useful in the 2v1 boss fights. And we get Black Flame Tornado. That's actually so huge. It's so rough that you get that so late in the game. Such a good Ash of War. Oops. Oh, we can take these off now. They're unneeded. All right, so we're going to adjust our Ashes of War now. I need another Halberd. Or I can put Flaming Strike on something else, because this, this is needed to be our Black Flame Tornado. So I could put the Black Flame Tornado on the Lance. The question is, it's going to be a lot stronger on the Halberd. And since it's so stamina consuming, I would prefer... Well, it's only got 40 more AR, honestly. Not the biggest difference. I think I'm going to rearrange it so we can have the lance below us. I'm pretty sure Black Flame Tornado is just more useful than Storm Caller overall. I am going to put Gravitas back on the Claymore because I did want to try that out a little bit more. We didn't really get the PvP with it at all. Alright, so here's the inventory. We have the Zweihander with the Stamp Upward Cut. We still have Storm Blade. I have Prayerful Strike on this just to see if it works. Spinning Slash, of course. I want to try Gravitas on the Claymore. We didn't PvP with it yet. And then we have the Night Rider Glade with Flaming Strike. And now we have Black Flame Tornado on our Lance. Spinning Slash and Piercing Fang. Perfect. Now we're going to wipe our souls, go for some invasions. Wipe. The Royal Capital, but they are behind me. Oh, but they're actually fighting the enemies here. That's cool. Hello, guys. How are you? Hello there, Bleed Build. Athena, hello. What if I did this? <laughs> we got rid of one. <laughs> Come here, guys. <laughs> oh, I don't want you near me anymore. No, sir. I just realized that we don't have our shield on as well. Hi there. Gideon. Oh, my God. Dragonborn over there. Next time you do that, I'm going to try throwing a Kukri. I want to see if it works. Hello. Ah, uh, I didn't have time. I like the elevation of the tree, though. It's working for me. Let's see. Uh, it, it kind of missed. Hey there. Don't guard for her. Well, that does so little damage. I almost don't care, except for the Scarlet Rot. I care a little about the Scarlet Rot. Holy... Is that the whole build? That's crazy. I'm glad you're not doing a lot of damage, but boy, is it annoying. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> no way. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, why would health be important? You're just going to stand behind your tanky phantom and spam dragon breath anyway. <laughs> We've invaded Elekin near the dragons. 
Is this part of the map mostly raining? I feel like it is. <laughs> and just after I say that, it stops and the sky clears. That's hilarious. Oh, I hear Moonvale. Glorious. <laughs> Excuse me while I do this. What are you guys fighting? Hello there. Hi guys. <laughs> the Moonvaler. Yes, sheath your sword, samurai. Bonk. <laughs> okay, so we have Sword of Night and Flame. There's the flame part. And then we have Moonveil. Let's not knock the Moonveil. Okay, I gotta hit the host a little bit here. I didn't get my hyper armor in time, sadly. Maybe he'll be a little bit aggressive now. No? Because I'm not doing the most damage to him, so... I figured he'll attack more soon. You got a lot of FP there, man. I'm assuming... You're gonna be kind of high level. Could be wrong, though. <laughs> it's kind of fun to try to use Gravitas. I haven't used it in a long time. Backstab. Backstab. Oh. Backstab. Hosts. <laughs> They're too <HP. laughs> Battle of the L2R2 over there. That's really funny. Did he do 1R1? He might have. Oh, nice! Right in front of the boss fight with Thorfinn. Okay. Wait, Compass. I don't think they're anywhere near the boss, though. They would have to be this direction. Alright. Oh, not close enough. Why did I use my flask? Okay. Now we gotta get there quick. Oh, hello, guys! That's... Misleading. It's a wizard, but it's using faith. So, do I want to buff my magic fortification? I do. Hi, guys. Hi there. You have a bleed whip, and you have... I forget the name of that. Serpent Hunter, I think. Is that his name? Oh. That's a lot of AoEs coming my way. Woo! Okay. This might be a good time for this, actually. So we have a bleed whip. They're hesitant to approach. Possible moon veil? Possibly. Come into this. All three of you. Okay, he definitely needs to go first. Unfortunate that he survived that. His weapon's put away currently. <laughs> oh, his teammate knew to protect him. That's not... Okay. Let's pull out a different halberd here. It's a lot of things going on. Hi there. I try to dodge all that. A lot of AoEs in my face right now. <laughs> okay. Maybe we can throw a dagger here. Whoa. Ha! Wow, that was an accident. No, I want the phantom souls. No. How did the host possibly die there? <laughs> that was, I think that was the one that I didn't even hit the entire fight on purpose. Okay, those three invasions didn't really net us much. I was hoping maybe for 10,000 for the great bow, but we'll just buy a few more stones. Maybe start upgrading some of the weapons that we don't have upgraded yet either. Like getting our Zweihander up to 17 would be beautiful. Do I even have the weight load for it? Ooh, I need one more stamina while holding the shield at the very least. Oh, snap. We can get it to 16 and then to 17. Perfect, now it's in line with the rest. And then with our last little bit of change we got here, a plus four stone. <laughs> now we head back and do Alexander's quest. Oh yes, this area. Always interesting. I'm pretty sure I remember the way. We have to go up first. But first we go down. Oh, guard broke it instantly. <laughs> I'll take it. I always felt PvE was nice with a colossal. Everything gets stunned. It's perfect. Dog! Natural enemy. Don't 
Dogs, uh. Hyper armor is a nice thing. You hurt with those, I hope you know that. Wow. He's a dex build. Did you see that? That sidestep? <laughs> he's got He's also missing me, so he's got terrible aim, but boy is he also hard to hit. At least with thrust attacks. <laughs> okay. What's this? They're guarding an old fang, that's it. No. Well, now we have magic resistance. <laughs> Yeah, it's not right. Right is the continuation of the area. It's like up here. Poke. Oh, there's something back here as well. Smelling stone seven. That enemy's oh, just chilling. Oh my god. That actually jump scared me. <laughs> oh man. Elden Ring best horror game. Now we go up the stairs and I think I need a stone sword key. I'm pretty sure I have one though, so it should be fine. Yeah. Nice. Oh yeah, there's actually a grace here. Completely forgot about that. Well, we'll just sit and get some more regen for free. Get our physic back. This one's still going, too. Cool. I love how it resets your physic, but any body buffs stay that you have going on. What is this? A Lord's Rune. Nice. Now, there's some items up there. One's a Golden Seed. They give you so many Golden Seeds in this game. I've been Max Estus for quite some time now. It's nice that they give you more than you need, though, in case you go one direction. And you miss all of them. Rune Arc. Golden Seed. Here is sparkly somewhere. Oh, over there. Hmm. I'll go get it right now. Actually, wait. Can we get back? Yeah, we can get back right up there. Okay, that's fine then. No, come back. Why must you run? I feel like a dragon's gonna. Hit me. This just looks like a big open spot. I heard the dragon. Would you stop? These are my least favorite enemies. I'm getting hit by fire because of that. But we get golden lightning fortification. You're not important. What's important is fighting Alexander. He awaits me. What's this item? Golden rune. Hello there. Would you kindly undertake my ordeal? I guess I'll undertake your ordeal, man. It's kind of sad, but I need that that talisman. <laughs> Amazing uppercut, by the way. Yeah, I'm going to say 221 with a fire weapon. Let's compare it to our claymore. Yeah, he's definitely strong against fire. <laughs> Makes sense. Oh, that actually got... Yeah, I like that that breaks a lot of hyper armor. I'm sorry, Alexander. Oh, you're alive. Oh. Sorry, man. <laughs> well, they got to give us this sad quest line to get this amazing talisman. All vessels are destined. Give him a bow. We get the Alexander Shard. We equip that right away, I guess. I'm going to have to change up my inventory. Maybe I'll put it on after when we do some invasions. For now, it's fine. A Smithing Stone 7. That's the way we go, correct? Parkour! <laughs> Hey man. Alright, so item down there. If we jump there though, we're kinda stuck, I bet. So we gotta go get this first. I hear the awakening of some skeletons. Oh, we got a cookbook. What happens if I do oh, I was gonna try to pull them off. Oh, that didn't break his uh hyper armor. Interesting. Wow, they are just tanky. Fighting these with fully charged R2s is probably the way. Or backstabs. Or a failed backstab, excuse me. <laughs> oh my god. Your damage is crazy. 
We're not letting you get up. No, 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 no. Not today. I'm alive too. No. Oh! What's this? Smithing stone eight. Smithing stone eight. All right, I may as well warp from here. This is an area we've been to before. All right, now we have a clean talisman inventory. Let's get some invasions going. That was some PvE questing. Got our new Shard of Alexander, so we can try that out now. I don't know why I came over here when I know I need to wipe my souls. That was unfortunate. <laughs> I just seen the name The Witch. So, the Shadow Hunter and The Witch, would they be... I suppose this direction. It seemed like they were on lower ground than I am, though. They'd be all the way... Oh, I guess I could... Can I survive this drop? I don't think so. We're going to use the recusant finger here. These are some random spawns. I don't even know where I am right now. <laughs> Seems like they are down there. Oh my god, I see them. <laughs> Come on, game. <laughs> I cannot get down there without you warping me near them. Much better, thank you. Although, this is poison. So not... Oh. I hate when I do that when I go to two-handed weapon. <laughs> well, hello, guys. How are you? You look like you've been hitting the gym, Shadow Hunter. Surprise. Oh! The blender! <laughs> That's what I get for trying to start with a backstab. Sorry, guys. That was rude of me. I should have said hello first. You countered well. Woo! Big explosion. Are we gonna <laughs> do it again? Yeah. <laughs> you know, I actually kind of have a meme if you stay up there. Oh my god. Wizard. The only thing you're doing right now is wasting your FP. Where's the host? <laughs> Into madness. True combo. Oh my god, that's hilarious. Well, as long as you waste all your L2 now, I'm, I'm totally happy about it. Can I backstab that? Yep. The witch. Name should have been the L2. <laughs> the host, oh my god, is actually saving her right now by just spamming that in my general direction because I can't backstab. <laughs> Oh, man. Definitely the L2. <laughs> Boom. Into this. Don't tell me you're still just gonna attack. Well, that is the beauty of the Gravitas into the R2, because they get pulled to you, and you get to start up the R2, and then you just release it. If they go to trade with you, or if they try to roll away, you get a roll catch. But it is pretty easy to dodge, so I like to use it to trade into them. Throws them off. I also didn't notice, but that phantom gave us 15,000. I'm happy about that, or at least both of them together gave me 15,000. Oh, this part of Landell, yeah, before the actual grace. Boba Chet. Put that back. How many are in there before we just go wandering in? Do they run right by the grace? Boba, come back. Oh, a wizard, you don't say. Oh, I went to eat liver, but this build has this spell. It's a colossal user. Oh my god, it's guts. You don't see that every day. And a wizard. <laughs> Hi, guys. <laughs> guts. It's okay. You want to watch out for the bubbles, though. The bubbles are going to be pretty destructive here. Yes, I'm coming in here. I'm protecting my bubble here. You guys look like you are going to fight me from far away, so I gotta keep that in mind. Come back here, Guts. <laughs> R2. <laughs> oh my god, no, host. You have 2 HP. Oh my god, I was gonna hit him once there, but he got frostbitten in two hits. That is not something I expected. Quick! <laughs> Give me the runes! 
I just wanted to get the host low enough so he'd back off. I always forget the god skin armor isn't actually tanky, even though it looks that way. Oh, the Forbidden Lands with Odette. This reminds me of a very long invasion I had recently. Toby. Hello, guys. How are you? Wizard. At least this area is kind of cool. Oh my god. That trade was damaging. Actually, no, it wasn't that damaging. It seemed more than he was. Hello there. If I could get you near me, he thinks I'm going to keep running right. Yeah. Oh, that's scary. You're the scariest one. The waves of gold user. We're going to have to maneuver around. Let's see. Maybe this. Get them to come up here. Oh, hey. What actually, what weapon is that? I was thinking. Oh. Oh, that would have been pretty anime. Odette. Wizard. Oh, yes. Well, the wizard has like 2 HP. Any more stamina? I don't know how that worked, but we're going to keep letting our regen do some work here. This is good. We're definitely wearing them down. Whoa. Hey, two for one. <laughs> I didn't even know this one existed. That's actually the one I wanted dead the most. They seemed the highest level. Oh my god, that's a cliff. I was in a situation there and I didn't even know it. I didn't get to put on my ring, sadly. Too much pressure was going on there. Interesting. The defensive heal up. That was a perfect block and I don't think he meant to do it. <laughs> but it was cool. <laughs> Oh wait, my ring! Oh. He seemed kind of high level as well. Not as high as the other one. We are almost at a level though. Would be great <laughs> if this host somehow gave us 10k, but that's not gonna happen. Hello, Odette. Hello, wizard. How are you? We play the wizard game. No. Come back here, wizard. <laughs> Kamehameha! Oh! <laughs> 21 HP, what a survivor. We'll still get as many runes as we can out of this, actually. 37. Yeah, we should go for another invasion. That will give us one level. I need the stamina. Oh, the capital. Well, hello there, Mr. Knight. His name is literally Karen. Hi, guys. Hi there. <laughs> I kind of spawned in a corner. It was kind of funny. Seemed like the type I want to hit first. Oh, the cannon. That's different. I like that. Oh, Ooh, nice backstab. Now he's just got a way for me to rise up and try to give me uh, with the wake up, but he missed. Unfortunate for him. Um, okay, this seems like a team that's pretty organized. The host would die quick, though. Unfortunate. <laughs> we'll let our regen do some work here. Gotta dodge that cannon shot. What? What? Sometimes the elevation's weird for me. Oh, night comet, huh? Backstab attempts. You know, we should probably. <laughs> I didn't know that hit me in the air. Probably put on some anti-wizardry. There we go. All of them have wizardry, actually. What am I stuck under here? A tree? Indeed. They follow me here. Hi, guys. Did you just hyper armor that? That's crazy. Let me heal that. Do this. Oh, he broke my poise. You just saved that wizard's life. <laughs> I've seen the attempt at cutting me off. Oh, the anti air. Oh, okay. That sword keeps catching up to me, unfortunately. 
He has some higher latency. I see it now. Um, we definitely want to guard break him. Maybe heal. Oh, I thought I dodged it. I did not. Oh my god, the stagger is unreal. But well, we live. Barely. Host wizard here. Oh, perfect. <laughs> Su Wait, Tukuyomi. I thought it was Sukuyomi. Fun fight though, man. You did well, actually. You were good pressure with your shield. You aren't going to be quite as effective without him. He was honestly working super well with you. Oh god, the moon veil. Didn't expect the wizard to have that. Perfect Estus punish, actually. The pressuring well. Although, honestly, the moon veil is the super easy Estus punish, I have to admit. It can kind of react L2, R2. I don't want to kill the host, but that's how it's going to happen. <laughs> I would have liked Gary Tail right here to be a little bit more aggressive at the end, but unfortunately, he wasn't. Fun fight. I have 40k. I don't think it's enough for a level. I think we go for one more. May as well. We're this close now. The Shaded Castle. Oh boy. Dan, no. Well, if he gives me 2,000, we actually get enough for a level here. Ooh, we get our stamina level up. Let's go. I love the amount of work we have to put in to get one rune level now. We go into stamina, then maybe we can actually use this Vihander. Moment of truth. Yes, medium roll. We can actually use it now. That's perfect. I think that's all for part 20 of the playthrough. We defeated the Godskins, got the Shard of Alexander, got a ton of invasions in, actually got to level up. And now all the weapons around my main weapon are plus 17, so we can start upgrading them further. I think next time I'm going to do this part of the mountaintops, then maybe go into the Moog area or in the Halig tree. I don't want to defeat Malekith yet because I know that does end any quest lines that I have laying around. So I don't want to ruin them, I want to check up on them first. If you guys have any recommendations for weapons or things that I've left behind for the strength build, feel free to comment them below. Once I am complete this playthrough, we're going to move on to the next character with a different starting class. I want to get a few different characters ready for the DLC. I'm leaning towards Hero as the starting class because it would be useful for arcane builds. Right now the Vagabond doesn't do as well if you want to be a dragon build, let's say. It's a little bit less optimal, so the Hero class could be useful for me. I really appreciate all the input. Until the next video, this is goodbye. I will see you all next time. Thanks so much for watching. Goodbye. Goodbye.